hello everyone how are you doing hope you're okay hope you are staying at home in this moment it's quite necessary for us to be at home um, hope you are taking care of your family and yourselves of course well most of you know me if not <laughs> i'm going to introduce myself i'm karin ortiz i'll be your english language for teacher um, it's a pleasure for me to be your teacher and to be in contact with you um, I've decided to to do the introduction of my subjects through videos because in this way you are going to to listen to me and you are going to to listen to me and to know my voice those who do not know me and um, and well and explain the requirements for English language too and the main objective of creating videos for my students is that to be a little bit closer in these difficult moments that oh, that we are living in in the world due to coronavirus well English language 4 you are in the final part of your career you know that English language is quite important um, you know this from the very very uh, first moment that you started the career um, how are we going to work with English language 4? well in English language 4 my aim is that you learn to write essays but not common essays we are going to learn how to write academic essays they are not going to be papers because papers is quite difficult uh, not quite difficult is more or less the same structure of an essay an academic essay but it's longer and it's it has its difficulties let's say but the idea is that with English language 4 you learned how to write academic essays taking into account certain vocabulary that you are going to use in your essays certain norms that you need when you write academically and um, the the final product should be an academic essay for fi your final exam not a short one a longer one it's not a paper but it's kind of i'm going to teach you to think critically i'm going to 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 teach you all all what you need for writing this kind of essays but apart from writing we are going to deal with speaking a lot of speaking for english language for it's essential speaking for in english language for and of course we have to revise grammar i'm going to go a little bit deeper in of course in language four we are going to work with an advanced grammar advanced structures that you are going to, to need also in writing we'll have extensive readings and listening everything related to language to english language as you've been working with during these uh, these years well <clears throat> that's it uh, more or less all the things that we are going to do we are going to meet in this way virtually um, I'm a person that like working with the ICT tools and uh, I'll be working in the campus with the campus sorry with my students uh, 
last year is, and this year I'll continue working with. Um, I'll make many changes as regards uh, English language full. So, um, and the idea is that in these days that we are, that we have to stay at home, we meet in different sections in Skype or Zoom. I'm deciding which one to use. I'm, I know Skype, but I'm trying another app that is Zoom to see it's, if it is easier for you to work with. Um, then um, another thing that I have to, to, to tell you is the, you have the obligation to work in the campus during these days, during these special days. But apart from that, you are going to continue working in the campus when we return to face-to-face -face classes. Um, all the activities carried on in, uh, in the campus are compulsory for you. Um, I'm going to upload the activities with the dates that you are going to have to complete those activities. So, more or less is a summary for English Language 4. Um, if you have doubts, please let me know. Let me know when we have those sections uh, in Skype or Zoom, because there you are going to be able to um, to speak, yes, with me, to, to, to have a conversation with me, to ask me doubts, yes, personally, let's say. And, uh, um, but please, if you have doubts, let me know. It's quite important for me that. Well, that's all. <laughs> um, we are going to, to meet in the campus for uh, these days and then I hope to see you soon. Please take care of yourselves. And one of our first topics will be con coronavirus. So I'm going to open the spaces for this topic, uh, this very important topic that is in our lives now. So, um, well, see you soon. Um, hope to hear you from you soon. Bye-bye. See you.